Number three, my vision was search for me. It was stick with me. It was speak to me. It was search for me. Matthew 7 and 7, ask and it shall be given unto you. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door, it shall be open. Your vision is searching what college you should go to, what trade school you should go to. It's searching what lawsuits to do next. It's searching what grants to write. It's searching what opportunities to get next. My vision is searching for me. Hallelujah. The Tanya testified about she had got the contract with this, this, this developer and she didn't know where she was going. The spirit just said her to go this, turn right, turn here. She didn't even know the place existed. And she got out the car because the vision was searching. It manifested within her desires. It manifested and they call it laws of attraction. So if you're ready to attract something, your vision will bring it to pass. It'll search for you. That's why people start businesses and black, backslide is because they lose their dominant vision. Don't lose the first vision God gave you. What messes us up is we're looking for vision on cars, vision on how to build a house, or vision on how to build a church, and vision on how to start a business. But the number one vision is to focus on how to serve God. That's your number one vision is to focus on how to serve God. Your number one vision is to focus on God. Then you get the vibes that you need. When I'm distracted from God, it messes up my vibe. Then stress comes in. Worry comes in. Fear comes in. Negativity comes in. All because I got too distracted on other things, on secondary visions, and not my dominant vision, which is God. Good God Almighty. Somebody shout dominant vision. That's how people get in relationships and backslide. They lose their dominant vision. The dominant vision should always be God. And when you get God, he'll give you the life-changing vision. So you got two visions. You have the dominant vision, which is God. Then he gives you the life-changing vision. Remember, Latanya on the toilet, God crying in the bathroom. God gave her, she was focused on the dominant vision. Then he gave her the life-changing vision, how to go into real estate. You focus on God, he'll give you the life-changing vision. So you don't ever have to worry about a vision if the, you stay focused on the dominant vision, which is God. Matthew 6 and 33, but seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things. Your life-changing vision will be added unto you.